It's the same question as the last one, really. Dr. Campbell agreed to Dr. Knight that the errors he showed are not wrong and that he can't answer them. So does this mean that Dr. Campbell agrees that the Bible has errors? So it's not the word of God. There are things in the Bible that I can't explain, that I don't have an answer for now. And I'm willing to wait until I see whether an answer comes. There's many places where archaeological things have proved that the Bible is true, talking about towns and who was king and things like that. And I think there's great proof that the Bible is valid in good history.